quite well uh, this season. So how has it been working under Juan and what are the things that he tells you in training that helps you perform better in matches? Not, on, not only me, the coach will tell every everyone uh, everyone's plan. So as, as per plan, we are doing the game. We, we are doing well. How do you think he has improved you? Uh, personally, I... Uh, my uh, what all my my minus he what he will tell I improve. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna play. Gonna play. <laughs> uh, Flavio, uh, do you have a question? I saw your hands. Raised. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, Romario, quite a lot of opportunities as FC Goa. How do you feel lucky, or you feel you have worked hard for it? Yeah, I also work for it. Uh, uh, what, what team wants, I want. I I am giving, so it's helped me to play. Okay, thank okay. you. Okay, thank you. Uh, any other questions? Now we can open the floor to que uh, for questions to the coach as well. Uh, yeah, Flavia, please go ahead. Yeah, coach. Uh, do you think uh, FC your team is in stronger shape right now after a six-day break? Uh, okay. Uh, and for us is uh, to improve uh, game by game, you know. But uh, of course, uh, in uh, in my opinion, uh, we are not in one hundred percent performance. Uh, we need to to work like a team. Okay, repeat, it's, it's, uh, I have very good squad of players, but uh, we need to, to be a team, you know. And uh, this is connections yeah. uh, need time. Uh, of course, it's very difficult because there are a lot of games, uh, there are not a lot of uh, trainings, and then it's necessary to, to work, uh, to work uh, with the pressure, no? because uh, all the time it's necessary to, to get three points. Right. Thanks, Coach. I see Srivats with a question. Yeah, good afternoon. Srivats here from uh, IFTWC. Uh, my question to head coach Jan Ferrando. So, Coach, uh, Hyderabad uh, lost their last two games, uh, but uh, they are also facing some uh, injury concerns of uh, foreign players. So, are you uh, surprised that by their performance till now, especially from uh, Indian players? Uh, no surprise because... Uh... Before to start the season, uh, I know firstly about the, for the foreign players. Uh, Hyderabad has very good uh, squad. Yet then, because uh, some players I know uh, before to start the season, because, uh, for example, Liston was in uh, Goa, and uh, I know the, the squad of the Indian players. Uh, this squad is it's, it's very interesting, it's very good, and uh, I believe in the, in the second round, uh, pay attention, because in my opinion, uh, Hyderabad uh, in future will improve more and uh, it's really necessary to, to put attention because uh, maybe it's uh, the surprise of the, of, of, at the end of the season. So how do you expect the game to be? Tomorrow, of course, a uh, difficult game because uh, they are very good in transitions. They are good in, in positional attack. Uh, they try to to build in game. It's uh, there are a lot of details, you know. When you play about uh, different teams, it's necessary to put focus in uh, two or three details. But against uh, Hyderabad, now in this moment, it's necessary to put in six, seven uh, points because uh, they have more options and uh, more uh, ways to 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 play. Thank you. Thanks, uh, Sandeep. I see your hand raised. Yeah, uh, my question is to uh, Romario. Uh, I just wanted to ask him how he feels about the start of the season. You are second on the assist table with three assists. Uh, and so how do you look at it as a start of the season? Are you very happy? What is there that you can improve? Yeah, I'm personally, I'm very happy. But uh, what, what, what team wants I want to give. So if 
team wins i am i am very happy if i assist to the coach uh, about uh, romario again like what is it that you see in him that uh, he's burst into the scene this year for fc goa and uh, starting to give a lot of assist also more and more he's taking responsibility so what is it about him that uh, that uh, makes him the player that he is sorry can you repeat please it's about uh, romario what do you see in him uh, that he started i think off the bench in the first game and soon made a sort of a regular in the team ah, so. okay. yeah there are a, a lot of uh, positive points you know uh, when can you watch the games uh, romario is very good and he understand about the high press very good he's good in press uh, he's working a lot in uh, in time defense he, of course when we are in a positional attack uh, he knows about the where is the free space he understand where is the timing also uh there are a lot of uh, points of course uh, my target my personal target is uh, continue to to working with him to improve because uh, in my opinion he has a, a lot of uh, quality has talent and uh, it's necessary to put his talent uh, in favor to to go you know but uh, okay uh, it's the first time to to work with him and it's necessary to day by day to to continue working uh, and to to prepare about uh, different ways you know because at the end the most important is the the players understand about different plans when we are in attack or different plans where we are working in defense thank you coach uh nikola naik hi yuan good afternoon am i audible hi, hi. yeah yeah yuan my question is uh, eight <laughs> matches so far and just one clean sheet i know you'll have conceded a lot from set pieces so far but looking at the teams that are competing for the top 4 right now mumbai atk mohan bagan jamshedpur bengaluru all have had solid defenses while your defense is still has to click i feel uh, so does the lack of clean sheets uh, you know concern you or you're not worried about that as long as your team uh, team is scoring goals and considering you're not bothered about it at all okay in, in my mind then there are two points uh, firstly okay for me i'm not worried if he receive three goals but if we do a four goals you know this is uh, the most important but the second point of course about the set pieces or, or, or for example three goals in penalties uh, it's very important uh, to put attention uh, why and in my opinion it's, it's it's very important to connect okay when we are working in defense line it's so very important to understand about the zones the space uh, the moment of the timing with uh, is necessary to attack the ball who is better for example in the free space who is better in zone who is better in man to man uh, in this case uh, we need time because it's necessary to to change uh, game by game depend of the opponents of course an atk or for example mumbai or uh, maybe bengaluru why has uh, they have success because uh, they know and work together two three years and then it's more or less everybody knows about uh, the points for us you can uh, check for example here romario sometimes we work with him in uh, in front of area sometimes work like a man to man sometimes working uh, like a free man uh, it's necessary to to find the best position for everybody of course but uh, in this case uh, i hope to 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 find immediately the, the the best position for everybody so coach you feel your teams the defense still needs time to gel together is that the case Yeah 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 but uh, you know uh, it's it's not all or the like this is depend of the opponent because it's it's difficult when uh, for example is an attack Harley or NC uh, for example the center backs of the Jagenspur is totally different when for example is a uh, in attack for example uh, I don't know a Krishna because uh, they are more as attack the free space and for example uh, Baski is like a reference or Harley is a reference in this case we need to prepare the team for a different point you know uh, you don't forget this players has a lot of experience in this league or in premier league and it's necessary to 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 work these details you know thank you and all the best for tomorrow thank you thank you coach thank you nikolai uh, abrish meena i see your hand please yeah hi juan um Hi. i just want to ask you i mean uh, in the previous game uh, hyderabad's uh, full backs were contained pretty well by kerala 
and that did create that did force them to say try and go through the center where even uh, listen to an extent looked a bit ineffective uh, do you feel uh, that's the kind of strategy you would want to employ, employ as well yeah i prepare of course a plan but uh, don't forget now for example in this case in the last games in the last two games for example uh, you assessed uh, the number six for them to change because it uh, has problem with an uh, injury and then plan uh, of the hyderabad is uh, different you know it's very important to control about these details in only for pass maybe i don't know they play tomorrow for for two with sandanza and aridane and it's necessary to be controlled for the for example in front of them of the the last pass uh in this moment we have more options to work in defense because uh, tomorrow we don't know who, <laughs> the the plan of the hyderabad more or less i was thinking or maybe in my dreams thinking about maybe hyderabad attacking this in this position but uh, you can watch the, for example the first game or the second game uh, mm. i think it's good because uh, hyderabad is have a, has a lot of plans, not only one. Yeah. All right. Thank you and happy new year. Thank you. Uh, anybody else has a question? They can raise their hand. I see Stewart from IPWC. Yeah, coach. Uh, just want to ask uh, any injury news from your side or a player who will miss the game. No, in this moment only Flan, but uh, you know he's a young player. Uh, was with us. Only Flan is in uh, in treatment and uh, he's working for recovery. Lenny is one hundred percent ready. Uh, more or less, everybody is 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 good. Okay, we have uh, some tackles with, but, but it's not uh, it's not important uh, injuries. And then uh, we wait until the last train today. Good luck for the game. Thank you. Uh, Sandeep, uh, you have your hand raised. Yeah, uh, coach, I just wanted to ask you. Uh, you speak about improving day by day, and uh, we see your team. There is a proper structure and the way you want to play and things. So, how far along do you think you are in the process now to be the way that you want to play? <laughs> this question is this. <laughs> this is uh, my question also for me <laughs> in myself. Uh, Okay, repeat. In, in my opinion, we have very good squad. We have a very good uh, players with talent, but we need uh, to be a team. You know, uh, how many times? Depend of the the trainings, depend of the games, depend of the. This is uh, you know, uh, it's necessary to to press a lot because uh, next is one limit. Uh, at the end, in my opinion, it's necessary to to thinking about. Uh, day by day working more hard than the last day this is uh, our mentality because uh, repeat here for example Romario in my opinion uh, he's uh, working a lot he's had uh, success in uh, the team in this case he's playing the first 11 but I am not totally happy I want more than Romario because uh, it's it's for future for us and for future for Goa thank you coach all the best to you thank you Thank you. Uh, Srivats, you have another question? So, Coach, uh, uh, FC Goa scored 10 goals in now, uh, out of which uh, 8 are from Igor Angulo and uh, 2 are from uh, Ortiz. So, uh, do you think uh, the players need to uh, buckle up more, to create more chances and score more goals? Uh, okay, now it's Igor, but... Uh... You can uh, watch, for example, uh, against Northeast, uh, Alberto Noguera has uh, two or three big opportunities. For example, uh, Leno against uh, Odisha has uh, two opportunities. Uh, everybody uh, has, at, at the end, okay, the success is with uh, Igor. I'm not, okay, I'm happy for Igor, but uh, uh, at the end, for me, it's very important to everybody has opportunity. Brandon, for example, in the last game, has uh, two shooting target. And, uh, but at the end, the, the goalkeeper, it's very good, incredible saves. But uh, okay, I'm so happy because everybody has uh, the opportunities. Uh, everybody can to, to have a time for shoots, time for. But at the end, you know, uh, okay, I'm so happy because uh, Igor and uh, Ortiz. But 
maybe tomorrow is a Romario or maybe it's a, uh, you know, it's a Edwin one action or maybe uh, this is a, the most important is that when uh, we are working in, in attack, everybody has option in, uh, in the last moment. Thank you, coach. Thank you, coach. And uh, do we have any question? If we have, please do use your raise hands option. Uh, we don't seem to have. Uh, so I'll bring the press conference to an end. Thank you, coach. Thank you, Romario, for your time. And thank you, everyone who has joined us. See you soon again. Thank you.